folks. Today is take down the garden day. After Thursday's snow, I'm finally ready to say goodbye to this year's Victory Garden. Despite Thursday's snow, of course, I still have plants to harvest and that's the first thing I need to do before we can pull everything out of these beds and get them ready for the winter. I'm going to harvest all the remaining celery here. Uh, I got a couple big cabbages need to come up. One teeny red one. And then I'm going to harvest not only the broccoli, but I'm going to harvest a bunch of the broccoli leaves. Keep them for making, freeze them and use them in the winter for making my egg cups. And I have to harvest the remaining leaves. It's been a great year for celery, even though I've been using it for weeks. I had all of this to harvest today. Couldn't fit it all in one bushel. I've put some of the looser stalks back here set aside because I will be using those first. This is a uh, tango celery that I bought. It's little four cell packs from Old House Sunrise Nursery in the spring. Um, I am going to preserve a bunch of it by dehydrating and I will also store a lot of it just wrapped in aluminum foil in my refrigerator so I can keep using it fresh for two or three more months. That has worked well for me in the past. Here's my final cabbage harvest. I left the two biggest green ones for last and the smallest of the red ones. All the red ones didn't grow very big so I'm, I'm glad that I tried green cabbage this year. Wait, there's more. I forgot about these two red cabbages on the other end of the last bed. Here's my final leek harvest. I will uh, slice and dehydrate the white parts of the leeks to use in the future. And then the greens too I'll keep. I wash and freeze them. And these are great to use in making soup stocks. Also use them to fill the cavities of chickens when I'm roasting or grilling them. So I don't let any of this organic produce go to waste. Leeks take the place of onions for me in a lot of stuff, and they, they're organic. More of today's harvest. Here's the last of the Swiss chard. I'll be keeping this fresh in the fridge until I use it. I already harvested a lot the other day. I froze the leaves to use for egg cups and things through the winter. Robbie, it's going to go in the salads and some fresh radish greens, which I do like these uh, filling up our salads. So that's pretty good. And I was out there collected a bunch of radish seeds. And here's the final broccoli harvest. Just a few little side shoots and then as many of the leaves as I could get. I plan to chop and freeze them again for egg cups and stuff. Those were the final harvests from these six beds, but they're certainly not the last harvests of the year from my garden.